So we've had a wonderful night seeing friends, catching up with them, and we've just got back and a cup of tea before bed, of course. A couple of crackers because we're being naughty. And yeah, smelly over there. Decides to let off. <laughs> let, off. <laughs> let off. And then this one here. Hi. Says his mum's cooking. <laughs> yeah, it's disaster, isn't it, guys? No, it's not a bloody disaster. <laughs> I don't believe how come you, your dad farts and it's bloody well, disgusting. And I'm getting the blame. Well, mum was spaghetti bolognese, it's not all right. <laughs> we didn't even have spaghetti bolognese. <laughs> and what do you mean it's not all right? You eat it, don't I'm you? I'm that blooming stir fly. We haven't had stir fry either. <laughs> we did another day. Yeah, but we didn't to give Dad the trumps, have we? <laughs> well, I haven't. My trumps are quiet. Your trumps are quiet. Do they smell? <laughs> um, no, it smells of like roses. <laughs> Not like him over there. What do you mean the smell of roses? They don't smell of roses. <laughs> yes, they do. They do not smell yes, of roses. Do. Yes, they do. Why am I trapped with smelly boys? Well, I'm not smelly. I'm, I am too um, cleaning and tidying. <laughs> You're clean and tidying, are you? Person. You're <laughs>
obviously was um, distraught that he'd knocked him off. Um, but yeah, he went to the hospital. He's got pains in his ribs and he thinks he's actually fractured. Well, no, he has actually fractured uh, possibly three. Three ribs. Um, they won't x-ray it because they don't, they don't x, um, x-ray ribs. It's all right, I'm uh, running away from the sand, uh, from the sea. So yeah, so they won't x-ray. Um, but yeah, he's in pain. He's had some painkillers. Didn't sleep very well. Um, got to sit upright. So we'll see how he goes. I'm feeling um, okay. I feel all right a bit. It's Mum's birthday this week. Um, and I'm also thinking of another family member who's lost someone. Uh, yeah. It happens, doesn't it? We, we go through brilliant and good times and we also go through rubbish times. That's life. Um, anyways, that's that. I just like a good stomp, you know. I love going for a walk with Rich and Jamie, but um, I can't necessarily stomp it out. Oh, it's gonna get me. I can't necessarily stomp it out with Jamie, so it's good for me just to come and get and stomp it out when I, when I can or when I feel I need to. While in Skegness, we also went to our friend's 40th birthday party. Where are you to get up? Right, lunch is now. What, what are you doing? It's bloody ten o'clock at night, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what is this? It's for me to be Spider-Man. Oh. You what? Tired. You're tired? Just kidding, I'm not tired. What am I doing now? I don't know, what are you doing now? <laughs> no, I'm not twerking. <laughs> You're not twerking? I'm not doing that in front of the camera. Oh. That's a bit rude. So what are you doing? Exercising. Why are you exercising at 10 o'clock at night? That's my daily routine. Well, it's not, is it? It's the first time I've seen you do it. <laughs> oh, plank. Just remember... <laughs> Don't call me a plank. <laughs> That's not a plank. That's more like a bloody humpback bridge. One. Two. Three. <laughs> Four, five, six, nine, eight, nine, ten. Three. Oh. Wait a minute, guys, I need to get something. 
Nanny Buddy does that. Yeah, she does. With empty plastic cups. No, with empty plastic baked beans. Empty plastic baked beans? Oh, with baked bean tins. Yes. Yeah, well, baked bean tins are a bit heavier than those, aren't they? They're not very heavy at all, are they? For me, it is. Is that heavy? Yes. Oh. <laughs> well, you're holding the other one in the other hand, all right, aren't you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can do this all night. Well, that means they're not very heavy then, doesn't it? You want to have something in your hands that you can only do about ten with. I can do that. Why, who, why you sound like who? Huge Grant. Huge Grant? Yeah. Don't you mean Hugh Grant? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is that it? Have you done your exercising? Oh, that's one more. Oh, what? This cushion here. Right. And I know what I'm going to do. Oh, do you worry me out just watching you? Mm. And I'm going to balance this cushion on my head. Mm. Yeah, this is a challenge. Uh, <laughs> this is a challenge? Yeah. What, like the hair on your toe? Not that challenge. Oh. That was my achievement. Oh, that was an achievement, wasn't it? Growing a hair on your toe. Yeah. Right, keep it steady. Go on then. <laughs> you like us? Did you actually come across my head? <laughs> it looked like Alibaba or something. I am. <laughs> Alibaba on his flying cushion. <laughs> cushion yoga with Jamie Vincent. <laughs> My last one. <laughs> That's it, is it? Uh, one that, more. That's your mind free now, is it? Yeah, one more there is. And I know that will do something with snake. Mm. Show you how to do this. Yeah. Like a mix in like a bowl. Oh. And that that for the for the purpose of what? Um, I don't know why. Oh. Probably it's my way. <laughs> I did it my way. <laughs> uh, that's my exercise just done. Brilliant. Uh, why you started them at just gone 10 o'clock at night? I've no idea. You, for some random reason, did. Yeah. Is that why you're getting, is that why you're doing the exercises? To start getting fit for the new job? Uh, no, it's not. Oh, it's not? Oh. It's for me to be Spider Man. <laughs> Why you want to be? What? What? When are you going to be Spider Man? In the future. Oh. Well, you're going to do lots of things in the future, you, aren't you? Yeah. Mm. That's a good thing. I'll be end up like my brother in the future. End up like Matt. Yeah. He's not Spider Man. Well, he's Spider Police, you know, officer. He's the Spider Police. Yeah. Oh. Oh, here's one back. Hey! Well, <laughs> he's just been exercising. This is why I've got the camera on. What? He just started randomly exercising about 10 minutes ago. Why? I don't know. Why, why did he randomly exercise? I don't know. He, well, he was annoying me to start with. Then he, then he went through a giggling fit. Jimbo! And then, all of a sudden, he ends up getting on the floor doing bloody press-ups. And then he did sit-ups, and then he's done squats with your ram bag. <laughs> and then... Well, it is heavy. And then he sat there for about 30 seconds doing meditation with that cushion on his Why? head. He just felt like it. Yeah, OK. Would you like a cup of tea? Yes, please. Uh, like a cup of tea? We'll have a cup of tea before we go to bed. Did any of you miss me? Did you know I was gone? Yes. You didn't actually realise. I was about to come out when you text to find out where you were. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be having breakfast before 
trailing you. No. Oh, yes, we will here. Yeah, we will here. We'll, we'll, have, the, we'll have breakfast in the van here first. What What do you mean about working on Friday? Learn, learn to say it's safe. Yeah, what about it? We'll be having breakfast here as well. Yes. We'll be having breakfast yes. here every morning. You don't morning. think you're no, going to have... You think you're having bacon flipping sandwiches every morning in the calf because you're not. Jim Paul. Honestly, what? What? <laughs> you, we have breakfast in here and then we go to work. Okay? Got it? I know what, I know what your game is. Oh, what's my game? Bacon Batman. I don't know about Spider-Man. I'm like bloody Bacon Batman, that's what you are. No, that's not me. <laughs> Everything is. It's not. Right, anyway, we're going to have a cup of tea and we're going to get to bed. Don't get chocolate too. <laughs> we might have a little bit of chocolate. Anyway, you're going to say no night? Yeah, when are we up? Oh, well, I'm not sitting here for the rest of the night waiting for you to say no night. All right, guys. <laughs> See you in the future. In the morning, I suppose, which is technically the future. Oh, heck. Right. Yes. Good night. Um, so it is nearly 10 to 3 in the morning. Um, I have actually just come out of... Boston Hospital. Everything's okay with me. I've actually um, took a family member in there um, because they needed to be there. And yeah, I'm tired. I'm tired and a little bit grumpy, I'll be honest. We got into the um, A&E at, oh gosh, wait a minute. We got into A and E at um, around quarter past ten this morning. Um, so I've been there not it's about seventeen hours, I think, something like that. Um, yeah, it's a long time. It's a long time. Admittedly, um, obviously, when you go to A and E, you're checked in. Then you do have triage um, and then you have various scans, etc. Whatever needs to be done. Um, but it's took that long to get these things done and then basically get a bed. Um, it's not ideal, is it? It's just not ideal. I understand that. I'm not saying anything different here. Um, I suppose I'm just having a five minute rant. Um, that you've got such a big group of people in A&E who don't feel well or feel awful. They're all together. You know, there's not a lot of facilities there. Um, there is a water machine, but some people can't get their own water. Some people don't even know it's there. Some people are really struggling because they don't feel well. We actually had three people. Um being sick in um in bowls in the waiting room and that's not ideal is it for us and it's not ideal for them really it's not very nice um this drips in the waiting room um people sat on the floor in the waiting room and yeah as i say i know i'm not saying anything different and I'm not having a pop at doctors, nurses, receptionists, you know, the people that work there, I'm sure, you know, they're not in it for the money. They're doing a bloody good job looking after us all. But my goodness, it's just so stretched. It's so stretched. Um, I did actually see a subscriber um, who came up to me and said hello, um, basically said, oh, I didn't expect to see you here. And it was a subscriber called Yvonne. So um, thanks for saying hello, Yvonne. And um, yeah, lovely to meet you. Um, so yeah, it, as, as I say, it's just my five minute rant because it's, it's not ideal. 
Um, so I'm going to go home and get some sleep. It's also, to be fair, it has took my mind a little bit off my mum's birthday. I'm so sorry, I had to stop the camera then because someone was knocking on the uh, the window um, just asking me where the ticket machine was. So, yeah, it was a lady. Um, so, otherwise, uh, I probably wouldn't have opened the door. <laughs> um, but, yeah, she was asking where the ticket machine was. Anyway, where was I? Um, yeah. Um, today is my mum's um birthday and yeah i've been worried about today really because she's not here is she um and yeah as i've said before they say the firsts are the worst um the way I'm feeling. Anyway, um, I need to get some sleep. Happy birthday, Mum. I uh, miss and I love you more than you'll ever know. Are you all ready for the day? Yes, I'm all ready. Good, good. So it's our last day in Skegness. Oh. I've uh, packed up the pod, which is out there. Drew's cleaning the van, ready for moving. We've got stuff sort of put down here out the way to so when we travel. And where are we going? Back to the campsite. So, yes, we're going to New Lodge Farm, aren't we? Yeah. Which is where we're going to be working for the season. So, yeah, I don't know how long we've been in Skegness now. How long have we been in Skegness? Um, I can't remember. About four weeks now, isn't it? Yeah. Something like that. So, and uh, yeah, we're four weeks, is it? No. Isn't it? No. Oh, th three weeks. Even if it's in three weeks. No, we've been definitely been here three weeks. No, definitely. It's not. It's five weeks. <laughs> we've been here for Christmas as well. Yeah, no, but this, we've came back after Christmas, though, didn't we? We went away and then we've come back after Christmas. Yes. Yeah. So we had, we had a month travelling around in, in January, and then we got back here early Feb. So probably about three weeks. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Right. Anyway, so, and we're on the move again. But yeah. we're literally only moving an hour and a half down the road and uh, going to get set up later at the campsite, at the... Uh, New Lodge Farm. New Lodge Farm, yeah. So, uh, and then we'll meet the other wardens. Uh, I think it's Zena and Sean and Anna we've got to meet, haven't we? Yeah. So. We've got you on the six. Ah. Huh. Which is three weeks. Right? Three weeks, yeah. Oh, there we go. Three weeks. Oh, so, anyway, so we're going to go and grab some breakfast with Grandad now, aren't we? We are. Then we've got some stuff to sort of do and pack up and what have you before we leave. And I think we're going to be leaving about one o'clock ish. Yeah, after so, lunch. After lunch. So, there we go. Right, shall we go first? <laughs> sort of language is that? Hey, <laughs> you're like torsion, you know. Right, whatever. Anyway, um, <clears throat> yes, we'll go and get some breakfast. Yeah. We're off. <laughs> We're actually going. <laughs> well, not, not that too, please, Mother. Mum's got her drive back. <laughs> Right, we're ready. Yeah. Hey, Good, go on then. Quick, I will lock you out. <laughs> the, 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 the travellers are leaving. Yeah. <laughs> mm. 
I did say it was on. It did wasn't you? locked. Did you? Yes, I did. Right. Oh. Marvelous. Oh. Right, are you coming with me in the van, or are you coming with mum in the car? No, I'm coming with you. In oh, it's bed. open. You may get in. Thank you. Okay. Have you, are you given Nan a love? Yes, we've had right. a Good, good. Bye. 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 Oh. Uh, right. We'll need to get some fuel, so. See you later. Bye. 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 Uh, we need to get some fuel, so I'll stop in at Borough. Unless right. it's unless it's going to be cheaper here somewhere. Okay. I think I'll only need about half a tank anyway, so. Okay. Yeah, we'll, go, we'll pull into Borough and I'll pull I'll fill up there. Alright. Okay. Yeah, I'll just go. I'll just follow you. Alright. Okay. Excited, Jim Bob? Yeah. Woohoo! Good stuff. So, leaving Skeggy for our new job. Oh, we've got a car coming. So, it'll probably take about an hour and 45 minutes to get there. We're going to stop off and grab some fuel on the way. Oops, don't know what that was. Something fell in the back. So, anyway, we'll sort that out when we get to uh, top up with fuel. And then we'll grab a packet of crisps or something. All right? Yeah. Cool. So right now, um, mum and dad's gone in the shop right there. I don't know what they're getting. So, so yeah, so you might see mum and dad leave from the shop in a minute so so yeah we stopped here for the fuel so we've done that and then head to the campsite so We'll see you about the campsite, guys. Next time, we arrive at New Lodge Farm, where we get parked and set our pitch up for the coming season. We start our new job with some decorating, and Jim Bob is let loose with a paintbrush. We also get time to chill out in the luxury spa. And I got caught napping on the job.